We knew data would be a concern for people because it's becoming much more part of um, layman's terms, data yeah. privacy. Yeah. What are you going to do with my data? How are you going to process it? So we were extremely careful that we leaned into the research side. You know, our partners are, are the anti-bullying research center. So our ethics are absolutely top notch. Yeah. We can't do anything or we don't do anything without first seeking research ethics committee approval at DCU. And we have our own ethics advisory board on top of that because at the end, we want to make sure that all of the child protection stakeholders can look back and know here are the steps that CHIRP took to make sure that they are ethically sourcing this data and no child's identity is being compromised. Yeah. We had to rethink it then. We were yeah. thinking, how do we do this? And we, we got support from the GEA, we got support from the IRFU, the National Association of Principals and Deputy Principals. And they basically put our portal out to all of their network of parents. And we, over the last kind of year and a half, we've been getting a drip feed of this gold standard data, but it is agonizingly hard.